Hey guys, so we're back with another review. Uh, today we are doing Matt Benedetto's 2016 Orange Crush Darlington throwback. Um, for feeling a little better, so hopefully this one will come out a little better. Um, earlier this week, I reviewed Chase Elliott's 2018 test car and his 2018 dual win. Um, both were good looking, so uh, today we're going to be doing a 2016 car. Uh, this one was probably the best throwback of that weekend. Uh, it's a very good looking paint scheme. Uh, this one is just regular, well it was a step below, I think it was just Silver Series. Um, but so only thing is the hood opens front tires don't turn trunk and roof flaps don't open um, but yeah this is Matt Benedetto's 2016 orange crush car uh, this one it is signed by Matt Benedetto right there and it's signed by one of the partial owners of uh, the 32 team, Go Fast Racing, uh, Archie St. Clair, I think his name. Uh, I met both of them in Maine this year, like the Wednesday before the Loudon weekend. Uh, so I got to meet Matt and some of the owners. Um, the owner's kind of hard to see, but uh, the Matt signature is... It's a good looking signature and we got it in orange paint pen so that looks pretty good. Um, luckily he was there and I was able to meet him. Uh, no, I felt a little bit bad for him because after he had signed stuff uh, he was just kind of standing and talking to people and didn't seem like a whole lot of people were talking to him. So. He was just standing there all alone, so I was lucky enough to have him sign this, get a picture with him, and uh, talk to him for, you know, five, ten minutes. Um, so, yeah, let's get into it. So, no race version, just uh, standard. So, you got Goodyear, Moog. Not really too sure how to pronounce that, whether it's mall or melee. Uh, I'm not sure what that one is. Edelbrook and Sunoco. I uh, got yeah, Mechanics Wear. This was a Sprint Cup Series car. Duralast. Sherwin Williams. 3M. <clears throat> not sure what those two are. Then there's Lincoln Welders. Uh, no name on the name rail. It's a throwback car, so they had it down on the on the door there's the little Darlington throwback sticker uh, on the B post there's Toyota that's Dr. Pepper can't tell what those next two are some more stickers down there yeah. champion machinery and safety clean American ethanol so there's the right side uh, definitely a good looking car. Um, I guess he doesn't have a lot of die cast, but this one's easily my favorite. Um, probably just his best paint scheme. Just orange crush on the back. Uh, same thing down the right, same stickers. Names on the door. Toyota Camry. Uh, the hood does open. Let's see inside there is the engine. Inside, this is Toyota Orange Crush. So there's that. I uh, went a little bit backwards today and I forgot to show you the box. 
So this is just a typical Darlington box. Uh, pretty sure they're still like this. Not positive, but I'm pretty sure they are. Uh, production number is 505. Um, just standard Darlington box. Out of 505, I have 360. So, uh, that's about it for this one. Uh, definitely good looking throwback and probably one of the better throwback cars we've seen in a while. Um, I'll be posting another one. Well, I don't know. I might be posting one tomorrow, but I don't know about part A or this weekend because I am going to the, I believe it's the Musket 250 in Loudoun um, for the full throttle fall weekend in Loudoun. I'm going to that, so I don't know what I'll be doing this weekend, but so I might be putting one up tomorrow but if not hope you enjoyed this one and i'll see you guys next time